I think the Big Finish originals are a really important thing to do because there's um, this idea in creative circles, in the industry, as people say now, that uh, writers should just be bought out, you know, no royalties, no residuals, that kind of thing. And the trouble with that is, in order to do it, you really ought to be paying writers an awful lot of money. Now, we can't afford to pay writers an awful lot of money, so our boss, Jason Haig Henry, came upon the idea of giving uh, the writers of original stuff more of a stake in it. So they jointly own the Big Finish originals with Big Finish, and the writer, the writers are all free to take their idea, sell it elsewhere, and Big Finish will get a little bit of that, but mainly it will be the writers. And I think that's a, a, a beautiful thing that Jason has done to um, to sort of ensure, because if you're just going to pay people tuppence, tuppence hate me and, and buy them out completely with no rights, they're never going to give you their best work, are they? And I think you need to have a situation where the writer feels totally invested in it. Also, I think if it doesn't do well, if no one likes it, then it's right that the writer doesn't make tons of money out of it. So it's kind of like, you know, the writer will benefit if it does well and uh, won't benefit if it doesn't. And I think that seems fair to me. And so I'm really pleased to be involved in it as a writer as well and to, to do my best, absolute best work. This feels to me rather, um, sounds massively egotistical, but in a bizarre way, I keep saying to people, this is my life's work. It isn't my life's work, it's the work of the last three years, but this has been in my head for the last three years. And, you know, I wrote most of it late last year, but it was building up and up and up to a pressure point and then burst onto the page last year. Um, so this is hugely important to me. And, um, and one of the reasons I can tell how important to me is that I'm a, much more fatigued at the end of the recording studio session uh, than I normally am with other things. I mean, I invest as much in other productions, but there's something because th there's sort of something extra for me in this because it's sort of in some ways all about me and what's going on in my head, you know. That's the thing with writing, isn't it? People can tell what's going on in your head by what you put on the page. So it can be, even if it is about crazy planets and spaceships, it can be a bit revealing. <laughs>